All right, everybody, this is my last package of the day. And again, this is October, uh, October 1st, and it's almost lunchtime. It's like 11, 1130. Um, I'm in the tree service, and sometimes we uh, do crane work, and it's really good to have some type of communication. So <clears throat> a couple years ago, I bought a headphone system. I really liked it and we weren't using it as much as my crane operator, so he ended up purchasing the headset for himself and his, um, his uh, operator. So, um, it worked for years and it finally started to break down. If you use it every, every single day, or three or four times a week, um, they do end up, you know, we drop them or, they get wet or they just wear out from just constant use. So um, he told me to order him another one because I really enjoy having that when we do crane work. Um, he lets me use it, of course. And so uh, I know exactly which ones to get and how much they are and everything. So he ended up, we worked out a deal. So this is the let me go ahead and open it up so you can see it as I'm discussing what it is and all the specs and all that stuff. Uh, I need to have a couple people that I work with that use these give a customer testimonial because that's the best way to, I guess, introduce this product. Comes in a nice little handy kit, little case. This also helps prolong the life of the product. So I'm gonna go ahead and move this camera down so you're not looking at my face, you're looking at the, at the product instead. So, um, EarTech has the phone number, uh, eartech.com. Let's go ahead and open this thing up and see how it's set up. Very well packaged. Uh, EarTech Ultralight shows you the on off switch, a little bit of information. Uh, the main headset has an on off power switch located behind the battery compartment, while the remote headset utilizes a silicone button for power located above the volume controls. While it may appear that there is a silicone button on the main headset is actually the pairing button that is uh, re reset to avoid the accidental powering off of the entire system while in use. Please note that while the EarTech handset system and are uh, expandable, only one main headset can be used per set. For any questions, they give you the number there. So you have to have a master. Here's your help number, 1-800. I don't know why there's two in there. Batteries are shipped partially charged. Uh, that is what the headset looks like. Uh, um, it's kind of like how do you how you work it. And each headset is individually wrapped. Um, I ended up getting, instead of the double, uh, I ended up getting the, basically just a single, um, cause you can, you can have ones that cover both ears, two earmuffs, but, um, everybody seems to like these instead. Uh, what's nice is when you lift this up, you can mute your volume so you can still hear but nobody can hear you. So say if you're on the phone or something, you can talk on this side, turn your um, mic off. So basically you can talk and still hear what's going on on the job site. So um, this is just a little bit better setup for what we use them for. And again, there's one master and t basically two slaves. So let me see if I can show you the difference here. I don't know 
why that one has the buttons kind of messed up, it looks like. I hope that's not. Don't tell me. That button looks like it's pushed in too far or something. Uh-oh. Let me see if I can get my knife in there. Hmm. Looks like that. Hmm. Anyway, that button looks like it's too far in. Hope that's not going to be a problem. This will be the third, the third one, <laughs> the one they don't use very often. So, anyway, I don't know what the difference between the master and the slave is. Usually, there's another, an extra button on there that might be the, the master. Anyway, other than that, these are usually a really good set. And here's your, they give, this is nice too, you can charge all the batteries at once instead of having to charge them independently. So that's a really good system. There's your plug-in wall adapter. It's just a nice set because that one bag control contains everything you need um, in one clean protective set. Um, and I'm not sure how far they go because usually we're, we're within a couple hundred feet of each other. Um, maybe like when I operate in the tree or in the bucket truck and the cranes there, we're usually, I would say, less than a hundred feet away almost all the time. But I think they do operate two or three hundred feet. So, um, so you do need a close proximity to each other. You, you know, you can't be like miles apart. You have to be within the same building or in the same yard or, you know, within a couple hundred feet of each other. So, but they are, they are just the difference between night and day because we used to use our phones to talk back and forth. And once we started using these, we fell in love with them. And they're kind of expensive for this whole kit. It's uh, 602 bucks. It's 560, but tax is 42 bucks. So basically 600 bucks and you get the whole kit and you're ready to rock and roll. So, anyway, if you guys can't find something that's, uh, if you and then you, I think you can get two for like, uh, like three hundred and fifty bucks or something like that. So you can get a little bit cheaper kit if you just need two. I'll leave a link in the description. You can follow along and uh, you can buy one, two, or three. But you always need a master uh, to set up, and I think you can go up to like maybe like six or eight. Uh, headsets and operate off all the same uh, master so all right guys that's all I have if you like the video crush like button uh, if you're interested I'll leave a link in the description uh, later on um, in the week all right have an awesome day